Saraswati is the goddess of knowledge, music, art, science and technology. She is the consort of Brahma and also revered as his Shakti. The name Saraswati came from Saras meaning flow and Vati meaning a woman. So Saraswati is a symbol of knowledge, its flow or growth is like a river and knowledge is supremely alluring like a beautiful woman. She is depicted as a beautiful fair goddess with four arms wearing spotless white sari and seated on a white lotus. The four arms represent the four aspects of human personality in learning, mind, intellect, alertness and ego. Alternatively, these four arms also represent the four Vedas, the primary sacred books for Hindus. Saraswati, known as Srosha in Zoroastrianism, is the guardian of earth. Srosha or obedience is also the wife and messenger of Ahura Mazda and her role as the teacher of Dhyana, Dhyana being the hypostasis of both conscience and religion. She also guides the souls of the deceased to find their way to afterlife. Her symbolic animal is the rooster whose crowing calls the pious to their religious duties. Saraswati is known as the guardian deity in Buddhism who upholds the teachings of Gautama Buddha by offering protection and assistance to practitioners. In the Rig Veda, Saraswati is a river as well as its personification as a goddess. In Hinduism, Saraswati represents intelligence, consciousness, cosmic knowledge, creativity, education, enlightenment, music, the arts, eloquence and power. Hindus worship her not only for academic knowledge but for divine knowledge essential to achieve moksha. In Hindu beliefs, great significance is attached to offering honey to this goddess as honey is representative of perfect knowledge. In Maharashtra and South India, Saraswati Puja starts with Saraswati Avahan on Maha Saptami and ends on Vijaya Dashmi with Saraswati Udvasan or Visarjan. In the eastern part of India, Orissa, West Bengal, Bihar and Assam, Saraswati Puja is celebrated in January and February. In the southern states of India, Saraswati Puja is conducted during the Navratri. Navratri literally means nine nights, but the actual celebrations continue during the tenth day, which is considered as Vijaya Dashmi or the victorious tenth day. In Tamil Nadu, Saraswati Puja is conducted along with the worship of weapons and implements including machines. On the ninth day of Navratri, books and all musical instruments are ceremoniously kept in front of the goddess Saraswati early at dawn and worshipped with special prayers. In Kerala, the last three days of the Navratri festival, that is Ashtami, Navmi and Dashmi, are celebrated as Saraswati Puja. The Jnana Saraswati Temple and Basar, Andhra Pradesh, on the banks of River Godavari, is considered only one of two temples in India dedicated to the goddess.